Hello everybody, it's me, and welcome back to the video. Now, in this video, I am going to be taking a look at... Uh, oh my god, Muck Buck Hoganosh. Now, um, I've actually tried to record this video like eight times already, and every time it has completely failed, so I was using a very clever one, and then I decided to just switch it over and just use a very offensive one. So, that's what I'm gonna do. And here we got Rejuvenate, Fiery Fawnet, Muck Buck, and Baneful Bash. Now, this is like extremely old i'm not really sure what is used now but it'll most likely be on the screen right now um that's probably what you use but i don't think there's any very brawny sets if there are good luck finding them i don't know but i think this gets you to 250 this is just to be as offensive as possible this is i guess to get you more this is so you can tank metronet's attacks just health and I guess you got speed ventation with 64 speed. I'm pretty sure that's how what it was. That's when I that's what I remember it was. Anyway, I'm excited. Hopefully you are as well. And let's hop into the first battle. Alright, here we go. Into the first battle. Now. <laughs> Two Bunaris. Okay. Definitely bring you. Um Let's also bring you so we don't die to Falkyrie. Um, this is a very interesting team, I'm gonna be honest. Uh, let's also bring you so we don't lose to Oxydrake. And I think this team pretty much, these three pretty much beat up his whole team. So we'll just bring whatever the heck we want and lead with you because I want to. All right, let's go. Okay. Bonari comes in. I do not want to tank my own very brawny attack, and I'm going to assume it's Choice Scarf, so let's go into Sakami. Oh, God. Okay, that's good. Um, That's good. I thought I was going to take more damage. Okay. <coughs> go for Body Crash. Okay, so it's not Scarfed. I got poisoned, but that doesn't matter because we got quick recovery. <laughs> mm, I'm just going to rejuvenate so I don't die to the next Baneful Bash. And so I don't lose to Oxidrake because that's why I brought this thing so I don't lose to Oxidrake. Okay, we're actually not really close to death, but I don't want to have enough health to deal with Oxidrake. Okay. Now we're going to go into you just so I don't die. <laughs> Mm -hmm. do, do. Okay. Let's go for an airplane. Take out this Murai. <coughs> okay. What is he gonna go into? Another Bunari? No, he can't. Oxy. Oxidize? Yeah, it's oxidized. Okay. I remember when I made my first Oxidrake showcase, I misread it, and I thought it meant, like, when it oxidizes, it... It was just chaotic. It was just chaotic. Alright, I'm gonna get on Pulse. Then I could probably go into Hoganosh after this. I want to go into Hoganosh. Okay. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Okay, Falkyrie. This is something that I did want to try out versus, versus with Hoganosh. So, probably we should end up just sacking Brittany. Bye, Brittany. <laughs> probably could have perched, um, got my Rachel plushie, and then used it. But I'm going to live this, aren't I? Okay, good. <laughs> I really thought I was going to live that. Okay, Muckbuck, tell me I can get my first kill with this move. That's no joke. I haven't been able to get one kill with this move yet. It's dumb. Okay. 
Okay, Bunari comes straight back in. He has no energy, so we're gonna be able to muck buck. Kill this thing. Oh, did he see it? Bruh, come on. That's messed up. Because now Sakami can't... That's messed up. That's seriously messed up. Alright, we're going to be relying on stuff for a bit. We're going to be relying on a lot right now. I'm going to have to rejuvenate here. Just going to Baneful Bash. Why'd I have to miss, man? Oh, and he crit me. Oh my god. How could that have gone any worse? Fine, I'll go LFH. And I'm pretty sure he lives Thunderstrike because I trained. It's trained well. It might live Thunderstrike. If it doesn't, then I'm going to get canceled. Okay. What do you got, buddy? Oh, we can't use it. Sick. Okay, can our Hawkernosh put in some work? Gonna go into his LFH, actually. Alright. <sighs> I'm gonna magnify. <clears throat> Thunder Crash. That's the first melee LFH I have seen yet. Okay, I'm gonna magnify again, cause I can. Then I'm gonna click rant and spam it. Okay, and now I'm gonna rant. Now the reason I have rant over um, like a chord move, cause I wanna be able to hit plant types. And I thought that was gonna be a good idea to hit plant types. I just really wish this thing got some. I, I really wish this thing got like life drain or something, over like rant. I really, really wish it got life drain. It would have made sense because it's draining the life from a computer or something. That's that's my mind said anyway. Unari comes in against another plus four rant. Now he also has plus four. Oh, I can see where this is going. Oh, I can see where this is going. I can see exactly where this is going, isn't it? Oh. Sick, he's dead. Let's go. Okay. LFH. Is that his last Lumion? It is his last Lumion. Okay, well, we're just going for a Thunderstrike. Well, anyway, that battle went pretty decent, me. Pretty decently. So, yeah. Anyway, let's hop to the next battle. Okay, here we go. Into the next battle. Okay. Now, here, Hogarash is going to be... It's going to be okay, I think. It'll be okay. Um, we want to bring you so we don't completely lose to Harv. Or we could bring you and you so we don't lose to Nevermare. Um, yeah, we'll do that. We could actually lead with you. And we'll also bring you. And to Clips, we can, so we can, for the, for the Cosmior. Mmm. <laughs> This looks this looks good actually. This looks this looks good. I like this against this team. We're gonna be able to break we're gonna be able to beat this team, I think. <laughs> okay, I had a feeling he would lead Bunari. So I'm assuming it's boots, and I'm just gonna peace of mind. Because I I know oh he's just gonna airblade. Okay. For some choice, he's going to crit eventually. <laughs> okay, I'll peace of mind again. I mean, I could just get to plus six and win if he lets me. But I can get up to plus two. He's just going to go for it again. He's going for the crit. He's going for the crit. All right, I'm going to perch so I don't die. <laughs> I don't think a crit kills me in this range. Definitely won't kill me now. Okay. Now... 
I'll airblade. He might go with like Nevermare or something. Mm, Akalos. Okay then. Okay. Now we can go for a Gamma Pulse. If he goes into Nevermare, that's fine. But he just wants to stay in. Alright, sick. Brittany's just gonna destroy his entire team. Let's go. <laughs> Some man's challenging me to a Fortnite duel. Oh god. Nevermare comes in. Had a feeling it would come in. Uh, let's go for an Airblade. Because I actually outsped it, which is very good for me. I don't care that I'm not supposed to outspeed it. I have been here for too long, and I just... I need a break. I've literally been trying to record this video for like three hours. Like, I started... Not not three. I started at like one, and it's now like 2.18. It's, it's been terrible. I've been trying to get the battles in for so long. <laughs> Hello. Okay. Well, I know I live any of your attacks, even if I go for a rest. So let's just go for a rest, and we'll Gamma Pulse and kill this Harma. Oh, he's driving. <gasps> he knows! Okay, go into, like... No. <laughs> I'm gonna go straight back into the thing he does not want to deal with. It's gonna be great. Straight back into the thing he does not want to deal with. Okay, now I can Gamma Pulse. Straight back into the thing he doesn't want to deal with. Now, I don't care if he kills me here, because then I just get to go into, um... This man's committed. This man's committed. Go like Hoganosh or something, come on. Not to Clips, man. I mean, to Clips works, but like, I don't want it to go into Clips. Gamma Pulse. All right, down he goes. All right, Bunari, Bun Bunari, who Bunari? No one really cares. All right, now I actually get to go into my Hoganosh here. Then I can click one of my many attacks. So let's go into Hoganosh. Now, the reason I have Toxic Essence over, like, Earth Essence is because I'm already boosted by Madcap, so basically all my moves are going to be boosted, which is really, really nice. Raging Howl. That shouldn't be too bad. Yeah, that's not horrible. All right. Let's go for... Let's go for Muckbuck, because Fire Fraud would get, like, let us take more damage. Let's see how much damage we get here with our Muckbuck. Let's see. I'm actually kind of curious how much damage we get here with Muckbuck. Bam, bam, and bam. Oh, quite a good... That's good damage. Okay. Now I'm going to go for Rejuvenate. Okay, he's gonna actually end up killing himself. <coughs> Which is really, really good for us. <coughs> oh my god. Okay, let's go for another Rejuvenate, so we'll just end up dying by Raging Howl. Now he has no energy, which is really, really good for us. And now I'm pretty sure that I can rest here, so I'm just gonna rest. And then I'm just gonna Rejuvenate again on his Raging Howl that he goes for. Oh, he's gonna switch. Okay, I get my rest off for free then. Nimere. Okay. Wow. I'm horrified. I look one. <laughs> All right. What's he gonna go for? Gosh, I'm dying. All right. Let's go for the Taze. Oh, he's gonna forfeit. Darn it, man. Well, that's that. That's that's fine. Okay, here we go into the next battle. Now, I don't care that he has an Operaptor. I've been at this for too long to care. Uh, <laughs> it's, it's just the truth. It's the truth. I mean, I care, but like, it's just been a very, very long time. <gasps> oh God, and I'm like, so close to being done. So, okay, let's bring the Eclipse. Okay. 
Garlash, that's a horrible lead for me. Let's go go straight into Zucatme, because I ain't dying. I don't want to die. Not at all. Aquatical Jaws. Zucatme tanks. Not Vicious Snap, but I'm pretty sure Aqua Jaws is better than Vicious Snap. I'm pretty sure it's better. Joel Tooth. Is this bad? I mean, if I can get another brace, I should be fine, right? I'm gonna get another brace. How much damage do I take from this? Oh, I eat that. Okay. That's good. Brace. And now I can go for a Rejuvenate. I'm pretty sure I'll take this one. I mean, I'm quick recovery, so I don't really care that he's getting me status. That's why I really like this thing over, like, Tundraland. Basically, it's a built-in dust, which is really, really nice. I mean, you can definitely use Tundraland over Sukame. I mean, I think it's... I think it's Tundra's a little bit better. It has a little more utility. Oh, he's going to go for the paralysis flinches, isn't he? Well, this is going to deal a lot to you, buddy. I know you don't want to stay in versus that. I can't believe a water type speeding a Joel Tooth, but here we are. I wish this thing got, like, um, flip turn. It'd be very cool. Ella Guana when I am plus one with body crash. That's good damage. Okay. Now, we're going to go into hog here. Now we can actually go for our Muck Buck, which can be very, very nice. Get some big damage on the Alaguana. Hmm. Alright, we got crit. I was going to say, that wasn't a crit. That was just a lot of damage. Okay, let's go for Muck Buck. What's he going to go into? Garlash comes in. Interesting. Maybe, alright, this is like at least half. I want at least half for good damage. Oh, that was a crit. Darn it, man. Okay. Let's go into Tsukame. I do like that Tsukame is able to tank these attacks. I do like it, though. Aqua Jaws. Alright, minus melee defense. Let's go for a rest. You might just go for Mega Chomp just for damage. That's what I would do, is go for Mega Chomp just for damage. Just Mega Chomp me for damage, buddy. Darn it. Why did he not do it? Come on, man. That's what I would do. You're unskillful. I mean... Like, earlier when I was doing these, um... Yeah, I did fight a Mudagon, and it... Oh my god, it was annoying. Huh? That Mudagon was very annoying. It was it was like a... It was a secret blade. It was one of the first battles I did. It was with the very clever Hoganosh, but... Very, the very clever Hoganosh didn't deal as much damage as I thought it was going to. But that might just be me, but... I think the very brawny one's better if you're going to use Muck Buck. Still got to decide on what I want for the very, for the other one. Other man. Muck Buck man. Alright, I'll take my slap and damage on this Infernix. That's a lot of damage. Okay, it's it's half damage. Um, Can I go Hog? I think I could, right? On the Fire Breath? I'm going to go Hog and then Rejuve. I don't think Infernix runs... Um, air blade right I know it doesn't I'm gonna rejuvenate I'm risking a lot but I don't think it uses air blade fairly confident it does not use air blade yeah perfect we get the free rejuvenate this guy is obsessed with switching in Garlash versus Hoganosh I mean I'll take my rejuvenate so now we can come in later and deal more damage okay let's go Sukame now we can just go for Zaku Jaws if you want but it should be fine <laughs> All right, now let's go for a body crash. Cause that deals some good damage. I'm probably gonna use Maroon just so I can hit Revenine and Ursul, things like that. Maybe even Ursnack a little bit, but I just like um, Brawler Ice as, as a combo. <laughs> Covers them them each other pretty well. I mean, I already have things that can hit those things, so maybe I don't need to. Maybe. Body crash. <clears throat> that did nothing. Okay. Let's go back into Vesp. This man's just. <clears throat> Come on, man. 
I need Hagenosh to do something. I want Hagenosh to deal the damage. And telekinesis. Alright. Now, let's just go for another slap down. Because we can. And then we'll go back into Hagenosh and hopefully deal some big, big damage. That's what I really want to do. Deal some good damage. I did actually, there's like this free set server that exists, and there I actually checked, there's no very brawny Hognosh. There's like brawny clever, but no other of those exist, so. Okay. Down goes the Joltus, that's good. What's he gonna do? What are you gonna do? Garlash. Okay. If we kill this, I think that our, uh, our Hoganosh can pop off. This man is too tanky. Oh, there he goes. He goes down there. Okay. Come on, man. I... Maybe I'm just really tired, but like I just haven't been really having a good time today. I, I don't know. I mean, I just wanted to do good damage. That's all I want. But I can't. Because it's tired. Okay. Hoganosh. I maybe I go for Shrewd Blast, but I don't think that does as much damage. Okay, muck buck, muck buck, come on, muck buck, don't go Mutagon. Yay, we got a little bit of damage. Let's go, Hoganosh. It's actually decent against Inferno. It was always good against Inferno, but now can Oko it if people are not careful. Now, I assume Mutagon would come in here. I don't know, I just don't think Hoganosh is very good. I'm just going to be honest, I don't think it's very good. I think the only good one is like very clever. It's the only thing I think it's good for is very clever. Mutagon does come in. Okay. I might actually live one attack, and I could go for a Baneful Bash for damage. I'm going to go for that. See what it does. Let's see the damage we get with Baneful Bash. I might be able to live... Oh, he went for the Frost on the vest. <laughs> oh, man. Dang, man. That's... That's unfortunate. Alright, I'll just rest then. He went for a prediction. Okay. Now we can go into Vesp. And we will sh mm, Shadow Sprint. We have to kill the Mutagon. He's also not going to do anything. That doesn't do anything. I'm just going to rest. Just going to sleep. I do... I don't know. Hoganosh is just kind of weird, if I'm going to be honest. I don't think it's very good. Not right now, at least. I think there's, like, too many things with resilience. Like, it's able... It's really good against... It's good... It can beat fire types now. It's a fire type that can beat fire types. Like, who knew? Like, crack a... I mean, not crack... I mean, um... What? Whatever the heck. Erupted, no, no, that isn't... Uh, like, it does ba it's basically like a Krakaloa in a way. Kinda. Mm. It reminds me of a melee Krakaloa. That's what it reminds me of, is melee Krakaloa. That's what it is. That's what I think I, that's what I consider it to be. Melee Krakaloa. But, yeah, I'm pretty sure that's gonna end the game better in the game, or else I don't want to click another move. Okay, yay! GG. Good game, good, good game. Anyway, that's gonna be enough this video. Hopefully you guys did enjoy, and if you did, leave a like right down below. Muckbuck Hognosh is kind of average, I'm going to be honest. Anyway, thank you guys for watching. See you guys in the next one. Bye-bye!